y'all welcome to this vlog so i hope y'all excited by the title but i'm so excited y'all so as y'all can see by the title i am doing a all pink girls pajama party it's a surprise party for my friend my sister in christ sierra yeah i'm so excited y'all so here's the thing she don't know about it it's a surprise so the thing with surprises is hard sometimes because it's like you're working around things. You're trying to surprise the person. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just hoping everything works out, y'all. I've been doing a lot for this. So not too much, but you know, this is like stuff I like to do. So it's not a big deal. But yeah, so here's the thing. All of us are, we got matching pajamas. Do not eat me up by these pajamas because on the picture, it I thought it was different. I don't even shop at Shein or whatever. I don't shop there, but my thing was I was going to ask everyone to get these pajamas. So I'm like, okay, if I'm going to ask people to get them, I need to, you know, shop somewhere reasonable and shop somewhere that the girls shop. So that's what I did. And this is why I don't shop at Shein, y'all. I'm going to show y'all the picture of what these supposed to look like or whatever. They don't look bad, but it's just like the feathers, it just wasn't giving what the picture was giving. But overall, they're cute as heck. So here's the thing. I ordered her. She was supposed to have a light pink version of these. I don't know how I mess up, messed it up somehow. So I thought on the picture, this was the same thing. But her ends are like this. So it's still super cute. So all of us are going to wear this one. She's going to wear this one. But hers are, I like hers better. <laughs> yeah. But she's a birthday girl. So I feel like it don't matter. It don't matter. Like she should be the cutest. So yeah. So that's that because so here's the thing one of my friends told her that she's going to uh dinner so she's gonna be dressed up for dinner so she's gonna be cute all that but i had to make sure she got everything she need because i'm thinking i'm like okay you know what i'm saying you gotta be comfortable things like that so i got her these shoes i got these from timu y'all because i got me some too i got me some black ones because i want to wear mine all the time but i feel like these are so cute y'all these match the outfit they match the outfit real good. So, yeah, I got these for her. So, she got some sort of shoes on her feet. Let me show y'all mine. I got some black ones. They're cute. I got these from Timo, like $5. So, like, I thought the bows was cute because, like, I'm going to be doing stuff with bows. I got some bows. So, in her gift bag, basically, I'm going to put, I got, I couldn't find a big gift bag, y'all. These gift bags I found. So, basically, she does content. So, one of our sisters told her that she's basically going to take her to dinner and they're going to do content first. So, the content is going to be at the clubhouse where I live, which is where the party's going to be. So, I don't know how that's all going to go. Y'all going to see. But we're going to, um, basically, I'm going to have a gift bag for her. So, these two gift bags are going to have her outfits in it. This one will have an outfit. This one will have accessories, which is the shoes, bow, and then I got a happy birthday sash. She don't have to wear it. I just got it. This is going to be her birthday gift. It's not that pink. It's, it looks pink, though. It should be pink. Yeah, it was hard, y'all. I was shopping at Dollar Tree, and I could barely find anything. And these bags, I wanted the real, just one big bag. But this is what I'm putting her birthday gift in. And I got her, like, a blanket and then a passport because she's going on the girls' trip soon. I got her this cute passport and then a blanket, which I will attach the picture to what this blanket looks like. I don't want to unravel it because the people got it folded up real good. So I'm trying to leave it like this. But it basically says, like, you are chosen, you are loved, and it has Bible verses under each thing. I thought it was super cute. It's something that she would like. And I feel like, who don't like the blanket? And I feel like it's very purposeful. So, yeah, I got her that. And then this cute passport, which is with the C. I thought it was super cute for her to have. So, that's going to be in the bag. That's her gift for me. Um, the outfit is going to be in the bag. And then her shoes with this sash, this happy birthday sash. A lot of this stuff, y'all, I got from Timu. That blanket from Amazon, passport, Timu, a lot of stuff came from Timu besides this from Shein, which is the outfit. These bows came from Shein too. So this one and then this one. I thought this one was super cute, y'all, but I didn't really know what it looked like for real. So I did order this one too. So I'm going to just put both of these in her gift bag and she can decide which one she want to wear, if any of them. So yeah. So I also got the rest of the girls. I got all of us one of these. I ain't gonna lie on the picture. It looked a little different. I don't really know, but I thought the bows were cute either way. I wish I would've just got all of us one of these because I didn't really look at the size difference. But it don't really matter, y'all. Or at least one of these, but I still got them for the girls. They don't have to wear it tomorrow night. They can wear it whenever they want to wear it, but I don't really know how I'm gonna set, it, set these up yet, but I did get one of these for everybody. 
So that's that. And those bows came from she and too. So I'm gonna show y'all real quick the gift bag that I got for everybody. I did got gift bags for everybody. And then I'll show y'all the rest of the decorations I got. And then I'm gonna bag up all of this stuff. So these are the little gift bags. I'm gonna put tissue paper, but I gotta take everything to the clubhouse. So I felt like I don't want the tissue paper to be looking messed up. So I'd rather do the tissue paper over there because that way I don't gotta like carefully carry these. I could just put these all like in the bag or something. These all came from Timu and everything inside of it came from Timu. Besides these, these hairpins came from Shein. Y'all, it's small, super small. Let me show y'all compared to my hand, maybe a better. Yeah, so it's small as heck. It's smaller than I expected. So I got a lip mask. I thought, and honestly, everything came out perfect, y'all, because everything ended up being super small with the bag, y'all, because I did not know Timu stuff be this small, but whatever. So these makeup um, beauty blenders, I don't really want to touch too much. Scrunchy, a face mask, eyelash applicator, and I try to make sure everything was pink, y'all. Eyelash. That's why I got the eyelash applicator. A mirror. And I only some of the mirrors were pink, y'all. Not all of them were pink, but a little mirror. I thought it was super cute. And then like um a powder puff, a heart shaped powder puff. Um, I hope I said that right. But yeah, y'all. So I tried to make sure everything was pink and theme, you know, according to the theme and stuff like that. And then I may I went that's the only thing I forgot to get was some sort of like pink candy like something like a lollipop or some sort of pink candy to go inside of this but if i don't get around to doing that tomorrow this is still good it is some sort of takeaway i try to stick with like a beauty like you know girly thing because we're all adults but i want to just do no like kitty stuff but something like a party favorite bag or something people would still probably use for the most part so yeah these are super cute y'all so next i'm about to show y'all everything that i got um, decoration wise what I have with me so far that I'm going to use for tomorrow okay y'all so let me start showing y'all this stuff oh, I just dropped it that I got for tomorrow so this is a rug it's probably going to go up under the backdrop or something I actually already had this rug I just washed it because I was like I want to use it for tomorrow so yeah because I want everything it's going to be pink it's going to it's obviously like a multiple shade of pink type of thing because she's a pink girl who loves pink so i felt like that was appropriate for that so i'm kind of upset that these are cut off which i wish i would have saw before but i just saw it and i'm not getting them remade but i did like these itineraries where i picture on it and then you can see it a little closer i should have probably tried to bold that a little better but it just basically just says sierra janae's birthday surprise which is like her social media name and stuff and her middle name all that and basically yeah it's cut off i'm kind of upset like, why didn't she? My sister picked these up for me. I wish she would have checked it. It's fine. I ain't going to be ungrateful. But yeah, basically, it's going to start with the welcome, dinner, games. And then I have one of my friends who has a lip gloss business, Bloom Cosmetics. She's going to come and do a lip gloss class, like lip gloss making. Because I wanted to have some sort of like main activity for it. And then a toast to the birthday girl. Um, I want, I'm going to do like these glasses, which I got a hot glue, some ribbon, like the bows onto the glasses for the toast and i also got some rose welches you know because none of us drink and stuff so we ain't doing none of that but we got rose and then we're gonna do the cake cutting because i got a cake and then we're gonna do gifts if anybody got her gift i hope people got her gift i got her gift but i hope other people did too so that, that could be like actual part so y'all yeah, this part i'm so excited about we got a mocktail menu i just this is pretty much the invitation that i made i just changed the if, like the I just changed the middle pretty much for it and put the mocktail drinks. So we got the Thailand Batty, Stiff Wear, Sierra's Antidote, and then the Rose. So I'm so excited about these. And y'all go see more of these drinks tomorrow. I'm gonna put this in a gold frame. And then I think someone is gonna get like signs so that we can kind of like say what drink is what. But I'm super excited about the mocktails, y'all. So let's see. This stuff I'm about to show y'all. I got all this stuff from Timu. So these are curtains to go for the backdrop. I was gonna do like multiple backdrops and stuff, y'all, but I didn't get to do the foam DIY one because I'm having an event on the 20th. So I was like, I'm gonna just do it for that. So either way, 
I didn't do that, y'all. But I got a lot of decorations, so I said, I'm going to just use what I have, work with what I got. So I got this traditional, you know, happy birthday balloon banner. Blow that up. Which I'm not sure what I'm going to do what with, but y'all could just stay tuned for that. Just showing y'all everything I got. So this is for the cake. It's just a happy birthday stand. The cake I got from Publix is two shades of pink. Circle cake. Just simple. I don't want to put nothing on it. The last time I got a cake from Publix to put words, I didn't like the way the words look. So she turned in 24, y'all. So one of these is a two and one of these is a four. And all of this stuff, like I said, I'm showing y'all came from Timu. And I hope these big, because they say the big ones are like 24 inch ones. So yeah, two and a four. I don't know, like I said, I don't know where nothing going yet. This is another happy birthday banner. Um, It's just extra. Also got some pink hearts. Which I'm still debating what I want to use these for. Exactly. Straws. I'm probably going to take the gold ones out and just use the um, the pink ones. But I thought these were cute. The hot pack variety for straws. Because I also got some plain pink ones as well. So these are like hanging, um, like the puff, the circle things that hang. Which like I so said, y'all see more of these tomorrow. More of like what everything actually looks like to me. So I got some balloons. I hope, y'all, I thought it was more balloons. It doesn't look like that many balloons. And I thought it had balloons somewhere, but I don't know, y'all. This is what we got, though, so I'm gonna have to make these stuff work. I really have ordered these for the um, puff things, which I may go back and put these in, but they're so small. I didn't expect these to be that small, like the, the makeup brushes. I was gonna put these in these for that so i don't know if i'm gonna go back and do it or not y'all because i already put them in a the gift bag so i got these hearts just scatters you know to go on the tables and stuff and then i got light pink too and these are the bowls i was talking about y'all i was gonna put these hot glue these on the like bottom part of the glasses um for the toast and these probably gonna go on the table I was originally going to do a pinata, which is what these gift bags was for, but I don't think we're going to use those anymore because I don't think I'm going to do the pinata. These are for the water bottles, some water bottle labels. It's only 10 here. I should have got two, but either way, that's stuff I'll just do tomorrow. And then I got some extra bows. These are just probably going to be like a decor piece as well. So all of that stuff can see more. Like I, said, I have another pack of plain pink straws too. I gotta get those. Oh, this is the last thing I can see too. This is for the brown. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be that big because I didn't realize it's only six pieces and six and six pieces. But this is like, so you know how I usually put like a grass screen or something in front of the backdrop? This is what it's gonna be because I want everything pink. Still gonna use it. Y'all see it tomorrow. We'll see how it come out and what we end up doing with it. So, from Amazon. I got these backdrop things too to hang up somewhere. I'm so disappointed that y'all, this must be light pink and dark pink. This is not pink. I'm just so like really glad <laughs> how unpink this is. This is a multicolor. I ordered pink. Like I'm so upset. And I'm really thinking about maybe like taking it back, but I don't know, y'all. If I don't end up using this, I might send this back. Which I try not to send stuff at Amazon, so it's just a hassle. But yeah. Pink. But it's four in here, so like I said, we got a lot of stuff to use. It's not that big of a space either, so it's still a lot of stuff that I can, you know, use. Of course, I got tablecloths from Dollar Tree. I did a, all this, the next stuff's gonna be from Dollar Tree. So I got like three dark, three light. I said everything is like different shades of pink, so I just tried to get everything in multiple colors. So I got some glasses. These are for one of the mocktail drinks that um one of our sisters are doing. So one of the girls, she's doing like a the Sierra's antidote. It's gonna be like a syringe drink. Yeah, so y'all see those um the Thailand batty one. It's probably gonna be in these cups. I was just trying to find some sort of flower to go inside of it. Which I might see about. And then yeah, we have these two cups. So I don't know which one is gonna be for what. But you know, it's good to have extra cups and stuff. And of course I just got some plates for the food. 
So we're gonna, for the menu, the food, we're gonna have Hubby Chicken Rolls. I'm making pink cinnamon rolls. And I'm gonna I have Caesar salad and then I'm making um, macaroni to go with that. And then somebody's bringing in a fruit tray. Someone is helping get some public chicken too. Someone else is bringing pink donuts. And then I think someone else is bringing like chips and dip or something. But yeah, we have a lot of food and stuff. And then we still have a cake. So yeah, that's all of this stuff from Dollar Tree though, y'all. Okay, so here's the rest of the stuff. These are some more straws from Timu. So I'll probably mix those, like I said, with the other ones. Got some more cups. I think you can never go wrong with getting enough cups, you know, at a party and stuff. And then I got, you know, that cotton ball game when you do that. So these are all the stuff in Dollar Tree for the games and stuff. We also got napkins and forks. So everything is two shades of pink, of course. Try to stick with the light and dark pink for everything like that. So the streamers, I got this is a game I do it a lot, but it's so fun with the blindfold. You know, the streamers and the blindfold. Basically, somebody got to be blindfolded. And you got to wrap the person like they call it like the mummy wrap. I just call it maybe the blindfold wrap or something like that. So I got the bowls, two big bowls. These are for the um, cotton ball game. You know, like when you're blindfolded and you got to see who can put it in the fastest. I thought that would be a fun game. So yeah, that's what this is for. And then another game we're gonna do is a puzzle race, which I was trying to find a girly puzzle, y'all. I was at Dollar Tree. It's, I do this game a lot too, but it's basically like a race who can um, put the puzzle together the fastest. It's 24 pieces, so it should be very easy. But it's always fun, y'all. I do this game at like almost every event, but it's literally always super fun. So I'm excited to see how that goes tomorrow. And I got like some air freshener and stuff for the actual room um, where we're gonna the clubhouse so that I can just freshen it up and clean it up and stuff as well. But yeah, I think that's pretty much it for the decor and stuff. Um, like I said, I'm just working with what I have and see how everything goes. So I'm gonna bag up her gifts stuff and i'm gonna bag up um her outfit and everything and then i'll show y'all the me like putting the gift bags together and stuff so yeah make sure y'all like comment and subscribe this party is gonna be fun i know y'all not gonna want to miss it so stay tuned <laughs>
y'all so this is the morning of the party um today is saturday so i'm going to make some pink cinnamon rolls i'm gonna just prep them and stuff that's what i'm gonna do next i'll probably just show y'all when i'm done just for time purposes and then i will just hit y'all back up when my friend gets here and we go down to the clubhouse to start getting stuff ready hey y'all so i'm at the clubhouse it's pretty much the space that i'm be working with so that pool table is gonna move in the corner over there and then i'll decide like where i'm gonna put everything else this little hallway part i'm probably gonna hang up like a little hanging things so like we kind of walk in the hallway it looks decent but my main focus is decorating inside of here and stuff so yeah i'm probably gonna go back to my apartment and grab some cleaning stuff like a vacuum and smell good stuff so that i can just make smell a little better i don't think i can move this pool table by myself so i'm probably gonna play for my sister to come over here and help me with that so yeah but yeah i'm about to just go ahead and get this situated and decide visually like what i want to do with everything okay so the tables are not even which is kind of disappointing i'm trying to lower this mine this is mine this is the regular one it's just gonna have to work though because yeah so this is like the main table i was gonna do the main setup at it's kind of irky because it's not even but i just gotta work with it y'all i can't complain just do what i can do best i think it'll be fine and stuff so yeah we'll see how this turns out three and three three and three if anything i can add one of those two to make it an extra spot but i think this will be good and i'm just show y'all the table setup and stuff and i'm gonna i was gonna put something on the ground but i'm just gonna use these because this is supposed to go together but it's just not working so they're gonna be kind of like place setters for the girls like they have something to sit on you know so they don't have to sit directly on the ground which i vacuumed and stuff but still so i'm gonna show y'all this table setup real quick it should be pretty easy and simple put these bowls on the cups on these cups and these cups are for the toast when we do the birthday toast so yeah i'm gonna like try to put them down here if that doesn't look right i'll put it in the middle but it's a hot glue gun and i don't want it to melt so i don't know and then next thing we're gonna do put these water bottle labels on these water bottles i'm gonna show y'all when it's done okay so these are the water bottles super cute and these are the glasses i feel like these came out so cute i'm actually gonna do this for my event later this month and i just wanted to test it out and i feel like this came out super cute it's simple but it's just so cute in extra detail so yeah i feel like that was really cute y'all so i'm definitely gonna run these back Y'all, we just gonna jump up and say it. <laughs> I'm gonna play the music when she walk in the room. Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna see something. Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> that's the that's this one. That's the name of that one. We have to do some creative. This was the highlight of the night, the DIY lip gloss making class. It was super fun. It's by Bloom Cosmetics. She came and taught us how to make our own lip glosses. It was super fun. It is actually a Christian-based, women-owned business. Okay. okay. I'm Julia, and my shade is Fairy Dust. I'm Brianna, and my shade is Acai. I'm Ruby, and my shade is Rosé. I'm Jada, and mine is... <laughs> I'm Sierra, my shade is made for you. I'm Deja, my name is Mocha. I'm Val, and this is Ruth. I'm Alyssa, and this is Misty Rose and Ginger Snob. I'm Arche, and this is Exuberance. Ooh. Oh, wow.